Michelle and Michael, this is the time you have chosen to become husband and wife and to form a family complete with Ashley, Amy, Eric, Jacob, and Robert. We are here not only to witness your commitment to each other, but also to wish you both every happiness in your future life together. Within the framework of commitment and loyalty, marriage enables an establishment of a home. Where through trust, patience, and respect, the love and affection which you have for each other may develop into a deep and lasting relationship. We who are witnessing your marriage hope that despite these stresses inevitable in any life, your love and respect for each other, your trust and understanding of each other will increase your contentment and heighten your joys in living. The key to love. The key to love is understanding. The ability to comprehend not only the spoken word, but those unspoken gestures. The little things that say so much by themselves. The key to love is forgiveness. To accept each other's faults and pardon mistakes. Without forgetting, but with remembering what we learn from them. The key to love is sharing. Facing your good fortunes as well as the bad. Together, both conquering problems forever searching for ways to intensify your happiness. The key to love is giving, without the thought of return, but with the hope of just a simple smile, and by giving in, but never giving up. The key to love is respect, realizing that you are two separate people with different ideas, that you don't belong to each other, that you belong with each other, and share a mutual bond. The key to love is inside us all. It takes time and patience to unlock all the ingredients that will take you to its threshold. It is a continual learning process that demands a lot of work, but the rewards are more than worth the efforts. And that is the key to love. Marriage is an act of faith. It requires great trust to pledge oneself to a lifetime with another person. Today, Michael and Michelle demonstrate their faith and trust by pledging their love to one another. Michael, will you have Michelle to be your wife? Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, remaining faithful to her as long as you both shall live? Michelle, will you have Michael to be your husband? Will you love him, comfort him, Honor and keep him in sickness and in health, remaining faithful to him as long as you both shall live. The wedding ring symbolizes unity, a circle unbroken without beginning or end. And today, Michelle and Michael exchange these rings as confirmation of their vows to join their lives, to work at all times, to create a life that is complete and unbroken and to love each other without end. The wedding ring symbolizes unity, a circle unbroken without beginning or end. And today, Michelle and Michael exchange these rings as confirmation of their vows to join their lives, to work at all times to create a life that is complete and unbroken, and to love each other without end. Michael, in placing this ring on Michelle's finger, please repeat after me. With this ring, I thee wed. Take it and wear it as a pledge of my love. And as a symbol of all we shall share. Michelle, in placing this ring on Michael's finger, please repeat after me. With this ring, I thee wed. Take it and wear it as a pledge of my love and as a symbol of all we shall share. When two people are joined together, it is more than just a marriage between two. It is also a blending together of children. In Michael and Michelle's marriage today, this is also the case. And I ask now that Ashley, Amy, and Eric, Jacob, and Robert Please join us. Michael and Michelle, 
You have declared before all of us that you will live together in marriage. You have made special promises to each other, which have been symbolized by the joining of hands, the taking of vows, and the giving and receiving of two rings. As you have now become joined in marriage, you will go forth into the world as a family. By the authority vested in me as a minister of the state of Texas, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. It is now my great honor to be the first to present to you Michelle and Michael Broad. <laughs> 